What's going on there, YouTube? <gasps> Big Ben with Twisted 420 has returned. <laughs> That's right, people. We are back. We're back. What is it, though? Is the question today, people? We are taking a gander at the Just Fog P16A. That's right, people. The Just Fog P16A. So here's an interesting little story. <laughs> okay, a company called DH Gate. I heard of them before. They hit me up. They're like, "Hey, we want you to review a vape?" So I look around the website. I was like, "Oh, I reviewed like all this stuff." But uh, then I found this little guy. Could be cool. And I told him, hey, "I'll review this thing." But they sell like everything. They sell everything from like. Com computer stuff to like knock off Yeezys. They got all kinds of shit over there. <laughs> they got a lot of stuff. So I was like, hey, let me review a couple of things and I'll review I'll review something on your site. And I picked this little thing. But the stuff I'm gonna review on my Chillin' with Twisted 420 channel is pretty cool. For one, we got a couple of sets of French Bulldog Bluetooth speakers. <laughs> kind of interesting, a little different, something I picked out. And this other thing is really cool. It's an arcade in a box, a little suitcase, screen, everything built in. Freaking um, 2200 games, arcade games, and uh, it can run off three 18650s or a wall plug. Kind of cool. I'm going to do a review on it too. So I was like, bro, that's like three reviews in one. So I can like, fire. it makes good sense. All right, people, let me tell you what the fuck it is. This is a 900 milliamp hour, 1.9 mil capacity, 1.6 ohm uh, little device box. I don't, I don't know what the fuck it is. You can adjust the power on it. Okay, now this thing's been out a little while. I think it came out maybe a year ago. Not a lot of people knew about it. Not a lot of videos on it. But um, uh, what's cool is it was just a little clear miser, a little setup. What's cool is with this 1.6 ohm coil, they also have a 1.2 ohm, but that didn't come with it. With this 1.6 ohm coil, it's quite suitable for Nick salts. Quite suitable for Nick salts. I got some of that new boosted Nick salts in here. Shout out to uh, the homie Corey. And uh, let's see what's going on in here. Bro, that's better than most pods as far as airflow and output, and it's really, really smooth. It's just a little horizontal coil in there, a little old school situation, but man. I'm getting too ahead of myself here. The fuck are we doing? Let's go ahead and break this shit down, talk about the packaging. Now the packaging is gonna be very simple, people. You open this bad boy up, you got some manuals and shit, but beyond that, you just got your device and your tank. No micro USB charge cord, no extra coil. That is all she wrote, folks. Hey, fucking 10 bucks. What do you want to do here? But uh, there is an interesting little illustration of how you should vape, and there's a weird looking guy right there. Take a look at that guy. He's got the vape going down into his lungs. He looks, he looks a little shady, looks a little peculiar. But anyway, that's everything that comes with it. That's all she wrote. And this thing, this thing is simple, but one thing I like, it's kind of cool. It has a little childproof system. A little, you gotta push and then turn at a certain little spot to get the bottom off. Yeah, it's kind of cool, a little childproof system. Anyway, you unscrew it, you got your coil down there in the bottom. Everything's good. You can you gotta fill it up through the bottom, no top fill on this little guy. But you fill it up through the bottom, stick it back on, everything's good to go. You got a little adjustable airflow slot up there. You twist the whole tank to adjust the airflow. And this 510 drip tip is removable, okay? So that's your little tank, little 1.9 mil tank, right? And here's your little device, man. And you just got like a little face, right? And you got this little button. Press the button to change the level. Go up, down, one, two, or three. Pretty simple. Beyond that, you got a fire button and it's five clicks on and off. But yeah, little levels, little LED little strips. One, two, three, one, two, three. I like pressing it. I probably fuck with it too much. I probably shouldn't be doing that. But anyway. Down bottom, there's a micro USB charge port. Didn't get a cable, but you do get a port. That's good because otherwise there wouldn't be a there wouldn't be a way to charge it. But anyway, anyway, this thing's tiny, man. It's really really small. It's got a nice little rounded. Everything's rounded. There's no sharp corners on it, but it's got a cool little shape and it's really really small and it's tiny. But more importantly, you throw some salts in it and it hits like this. Very open. I'd say it's not very, I mean, you can close it down to get more of a mouth alone. It is 1.6 ohm and everything is small, but wide open, it's like a restricted lung inhale. And that's pretty cool to me. And that's how I like to vape, no matter the size of what I'm vaping or what I'm vaping, Nick sauce included. And with the airflow wide open, this thing on power setting three, I leave it on three. I like the, I like to go hard in the paint, not soft in the paint. You know what I mean? I leave it on power setting three, I fucking get down. Okay, here's the thing, man. 
When you start talking about a $10 device free shipping, you gotta throw some cons out the window. Doesn't come with a micro USB charge cable, but I bet you, including myself, have 50 million of those fucks. So hey, not too shabby. Doesn't come with any extra coils. Sure, you can buy some more or whatever, but it does come with one and a tank, and the battery comes charged. Um, I'm trying to think. You throw some Nick salts in here, maybe even some regular uh, liquid higher nicotine. You're gonna be doing great. You're gonna be doing great. I wish I could have tested the 1.2 ohm coil. It was probably even cooler or warmer, shall I say. Ha, see what I did there? But overall, man, I can't bitch. 10 bucks, pretty cool. Pretty cool, little Just Fog. I reviewed some Just Fog things in the past. They, they've made some stuff, but this one's cool. It's been out a while, but still, I think it's cool. For the current climate, everybody doing Nick sauce and shit, this guy slots right in, perfect. Links are in the description if you wanna go look around. Take Gander, I don't give a shit. But I told you, and that's worth just a little. A little bit of something, just a little bit of something, okay? So that being said, thank you for watching. I truly do appreciate it. You guys are fantastic. And remember, it doesn't matter what the fuck you're vaping on, as long as you're not on them gosh darn stinkies. That's what's important. And last but not least, you stay sexy, YouTube. Me and this Just Fog P16A, we're out. Vaping saves more lives than $10 vapes and French Bulldog speakers.